Fellow Kenyans, members of the press, ladies and gentlemen, we have gathered here as one Kenya Alliance, fully cognizant that we carry the aspirations of millions of Kenyans who yearn for just, inclusive and prosperous nation anchored on the rule of law and equitable distribution of resources. Hence, we wish to bring the public up to speed with the progress of OCA. One, to formally incorporate all the constituent political parties into the One Kenya Alliance. We are glad to inform Kenyans that this morning, OCA principals have signed a deed of assignment. This is an affirmation of our commitment to standing firm together and focus on securing the lives of Kenyans. Additionally, we have finalized on the OCA coalition agreement, which details the nature and extent of our political engagement and cooperation as partners. Therefore, on Monday, February 28th, 2022, we shall officially deposit it with the Register of Political Parties as OCA Coalition. Two, we finally, we will officially and publicly unveil the One Kenya Alliance Coalition and demonstrate how our vision will fundamentally transform Kenya. As a build up towards the official unveiling, we have lined up a series of public engagements, activities to be hosted by constituent political parties and partners in various parts of the country. Three, our resolve emanates from the resilience we have witnessed among Kenyans in our recent political tours. Indeed, they deeply desire le leadership with a solemn responsibility to build a responsive and sustainable economy, promote the rule of law, and restore the decency of living within our borders. Four, as an alliance governed by values and principles of equality, equity, sustainable development, empowered citizen and zero tolerance to corruption, we are open to honest engagements with other political formations which, and which share in our ideology. This, this shall involve structured and open negotiations, which must include resolution of the country's crippling debt portfolio and discussion of exploration of our natural resources to address the debt and create employment for a largely unemployed youth, among other important issues. As of today, Several other political parties have expressed interest in joining the coalition. This is because we believe that the diversity in our nation calls for heterogeneity of minds and ideas to effect um, impactful changes. Finally, we urge Kenyans to exercise their civic duty to register as voters in the remaining four days of the enhanced voter registration. God bless Oka. God bless Kenya. One Kenya. One Kenya. One Kenya. One people. We're ready to field a few questions. And please uh, be understanding, because we must walk this journey with you, particularly members of the for the state. Um, I saw gracious lady 
Maybe you can mention the name and the media house. Yeah. Chemutai. I know Chemutai. <laughs> Well, we, that assertion has been there. And that is why in our written statement, we are said we are open to like-minded uh, political formations. But the mode of engagement in that type of dialogue shall be open, inclusive, transparent, fully consultative. Um, if indeed... Uh, because it is clear that there have been those approaches, we intend to involve the party organs. I'm aware that Kano, for instance, will have uh, their National Executive Council in the coming few days. WIPA as well will have their National Executive Council in the coming few days. And I'm sure that now Kenya and, and uh, UDP will also be moving in that direction. There is no urgency. We have up to the 9th of April to form mm. any political uh, mm. coalitions. Mm. But we have made it clear to the Kenyan people that others are free to join us, not the other way around. <laughs> Thank you. That is good. Yes, uh, Kennedy. <laughs> we have our own history, my son. Uh, well, with regards to honest coalitions, is Kenya Kwanzaa an option? Kenya Kwanzaa? Mm -hmm. Has yeah. it been registered? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Are you talk about Kenya Kwisha? Yeah. <laughs> 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 Yeah, <laughs> now they'll be dealt with by the Buffalo soldier. <laughs> Buffalo soldier. The only option is to probably team up with uh, I don't think you can talk of only option. No. We are not able to. We don't want to, to go that way. Mm -hmm. But our minds are very clear. Mm -hmm. We don't talk in absolute terms. Mm -hmm. Because we are Kenyans. The Kenyans need each other. Mm -hmm. But they are basic benchmarks and basic considerations. We talked of commonality of ideology. If you are fighting against corruption, mm. you cannot come to me, Kennedy, and say, mm -hmm. you are Lord, you have a debt burden mm. out of stealing people's resources, public resources, and expect that you will meet your halfway. I don't want to speculate. Well, I don't think I should speculate or indeed anticipate debate. Mm. You know, there's such a thing in Parliament as anticipating, anticipating debate. Yeah. Mm. Uh, we want to meet every member of the National Executive Council of WIPA, for instance. Mm. We love their free say, and we'll come up with a resolution, one or the other. Um, so, let me not anticipate that. Uh, Rimi, Rimi Wangi, even if you wear a mask, I know you. <laughs> <laughs> and Kirinyaga. Just two, four meetings, because we accused of boardroom discussions, we only went out to four places. Imagine what will happen when we cover the whole country. And we are set. Yes. But specifically on the Ukambani one, you had another partner in the campaign in the name of Jimmy Wangi. Oh, I see. Is he also one of those that you'll be speaking to? No, Jimmy made it very clear that he's in ODM. Mm. And until they resolve their own issues as ODM, he's not on the table. And on the issue of agreement consensus? Well, we, the, the technical team have done a beautiful job. They will brief the principals on that. And we will, I'm quite sure... You know now, these, these are people who know each other very well. Mm -hmm. You don't expect any, any disagreements, even on the power sharing matrix or whatever the matrix or the structure of our own leadership. I don't think there will be any issues. We will be moving. The important thing is the commonality of approach and interest, always guided but what it, by what is in the best interest of, of Kenyans. What do you mean? I may say I think Mother can answer that. <laughs> Thank you. We must all agree that a coalition is not a jail where the doors are closed. Yeah. The doors remain open 
for incoming partners and everybody is free to exercise their freedom. Absolutely. But I think we are on solid ground. That is the wow. message. Thank you. Thank you. Yes. The next question will be taken by yes. CJ. Which one is that? Yes. Come. <laughs> you are also anticipating debate. Yeah. But surely when you look at uh, the composition here, Mutai Nguni came up with something. We have two things in our favor. Tyranny of numbers mm -hmm. and experienced leadership. Yeah. Yeah. What else yeah. can be looking for? Yeah. And the principled leaders. Yeah. Yes. All that is combined here. Oh, yes. People respect the rule of law. Yes. Enough, my friend. <laughs> 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 yes. Mount Kenya Unity Forum, which met yesterday, had already initiated talks with OCA. Parallel to NAC Kenya's talk, because I also lead NAC Kenya Party. And you have heard the statement that this coalition is open to the like minded. Without anticipating debate, those talks are ongoing, seriously. Well done. Wow. Enough. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.